Hello, I'm Jamie Shibley, CEO of The Expressory. Today, I want to talk to you about spending the money on your holiday gifts. Uh, about this time of year, as people are planning uh, what to give, how many people to give to, how much to spend, um, you know, we usually start getting a lot of questions about um, the budget and um, people have a lot of conflict about, well, it starts to add up really quickly, right? Um, so I want to give you a story about uh, our doggy daycare and the thing they got right. Uh, so we have two dogs. We are huge dog people. We've always had dogs. Um, you could say we're rather obsessed. And we will probably always have dogs. Now, the, the two dogs we have, um, they're pretty active. And since we both work full time, they spend time at doggy daycare a couple times a week, maybe two to three days a week. Um, and we, it's what, they're eight years old and they've been going since we got them. And um, every year our dog daycare sends um, a holiday card, really cute with pictures. Um, and usually on the back of it, it says, bring this card, present this card um, to receive one day of daycare for your dogs as a token of our appreciation. So, you know, they've been doing that for years now. It's probably been their thing. Um, but last year we got their card. And um, while it had that message on the back, inside for us was also a gift card that just shocked the heck out of us. Um, it was good for a package of 30 days of daycare, which is about the package that we normally renew. So these dogs can go get rid of their energy. Now, that package is worth $700. Now, you think about, um, well, first of all, don't think about how much we spend on our animals. However, think about the value to them. I mean, we were blown away. Dog people are dog people, and they know dog people. Same with cats, right? We know others, and we tell others. And so what they did is they segmented their top clients and they gifted us a heck of a package um, for, for the holidays. Now, for appreciation, it didn't necessarily cost them out of pocket, right? So it wasn't like they forked up this spend. Um, so that's one way that, that can be helpful for our budgets, right? However, it does cost them that we're getting, you know, a month of this time um, on them. And it's huge, right? To our, think about, I'm sharing this with all of you. I will share this with anybody in our area that we know. What they just spent money on is creating ambassadors because what they know is that we will talk about it. And they've also got us, right? Our loyalty. What are the, the chances are we're, we're going to have more dogs <laughs> and we're going to continue probably to send our dogs um, to their location. And so they know for the long term, we are now, <laughs> we're loyal customers. I mean, we were, <laughs> right? But that's what they got right. And so I tell you this story because just keep that in the back of your mind as you're planning your cutoffs. Like, well, who who do I spend this money on? And oh my God, do I really want to spend this money? I get it. We all do that. But consider this your advertising spend, okay? Because your people, just like dog people, if they're your people, they're going to talk about it. And they're going to tell others who should be your people. And that's really what you're spending the money on. All right, so I, I hope that helps as you're working your way through your planning stages. Always here for a conversation if you need anything. Thanks for listening.